Tyler Jordan says he and his band Good Looks love to perform. He's the guitarist and songwriter for the Austin indie rock group with songs that tackle politics and the so-called system. I think most songwriters just kind of want to be heard or understood, and so that's like a big part of playing live too, right? They were set to perform at South by Southwest for the third year, but instead his band is joining more than 60 other performers in a boycott of the festival. It was a really hard decision to come to. We kind of went back and forth, and um, I will say we, we weren't the first band to do it. The Austin for Palestine Coalition organized the boycott to protest the inclusion of festival and conference participants Raytheon, its parent company Collins Aerospace, and BAE Systems for their role in helping supply Israel with military equipment and arms. We wanted to alert these musicians that South by Southwest was platforming these military contractors and simply ask them to make a statement. Gaza's health ministry says the Israel-Palestine conflict in Gaza has left more than 31,000 Palestinians dead. This follows an October attack by the terrorist group Hamas that killed 1,200 Israelis and left hundreds more held hostage. At the end of the day, what we want is these military contractors out of our cultural spaces. Governor Greg Abbott reacted to the boycott on the social media platform X, formerly known as Twitter, writing, quote, Bye, don't come back. We're proud of the U.S. military in Texas. South by Southwest replied with its own thread saying they do not agree with the governor. Instead, it respects the artist's freedom of speech as an organization that welcomes diverse viewpoints. South by went on to call what's happening in the Middle East tragic, while adding, the defense industry has historically been a proving ground for many of the systems we rely on today and are leaders in emerging technologies. Jordan says all these artists coming together is inspiring, and he hopes the movement only continues to grow. I think that we're powerful together, and that's really clear. Reporting in Austin, Andrew Freeman, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.